Oh, Julia White. There's a free hit. He's got his man, McCoy. He's got the win of the brain. That was it. Bang it in that area. Shot off a length. With that, it's taken the outside edge too. It's a good bowling. Good adjustment after being driven down the ground. Getting the length right and the line. He's got an account as well, so they can double it. So, <laughs> yeah, well done to him. Yeah, the dropped ones were taking inspiration from Kevin Peterson. Thank you so much, Shark, for your time. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, well, it's a catch. Just been talking about a catch. And it's such a big wicket. It's a huge wicket. Jacques Callis has just talked about the fact that uh, unless they get bowled out, they should win this game. I think it's going to be a little bit harder than that. They feel the backward point back. Catch. Go! Yes, man. Oh, there's the bounce. It's the push through the offside. The fielding change. Hobie McCoy continues the good work from Centurion. There's the first wicket down. Managed to hit that surface hard. It's the angle again, but look at that bounce. Got steep on him. Took the edge through to the wicket keeper, Butler. And yeah, he's got his man, Obet McCoy. And 44. Short that time. Now that should be out. That's just popped up. That's a bit of a soft dismissal. No one early won't be too happy about that, I'm sure. So they're in big trouble now. I mean, I think in that last over that he bowled in Pretoria the other evening, he bowled so many of them. He also has pace on. But I think you've got to set yourself at this stage of the game and this type of wicket for the slower ball and then react if it's a little bit quicker. He said that high. Straight up, really. And it should be taken. Petra Quayle is underneath that. And number 69 does the job. Well, well. Smoked it to all parts. As Ryan Rickleton in this tournament, and he's gone for that shot we've seen so many times. Not off the middle of the bat. Up it goes. Called for it straight away, was under it. Lovely base, good hands on. <laughs> should be, should be, is. McCoy has got two, he's been brilliant with his use of conditions. This part Royals team and crowd. We've said it's staying low, but when you've got a fast bowler hitting the wicket as hard as they are, putting effort into every single delivery, this is what happens. There it is, there it is, and a wicket straight away. Fortain takes that catch comfortably, and Fortain is on his way. To celebrate, that is, and to Swarzy is on his way. No visual clues as a batsman because of the quick arm action. Tony De Zorzi threw the shot way too early. And that is as easy as you'll get him. Fortain is back with points. He's picked him out. Tries to drag him to mid-wicket. And all he can do is find the fielder. Brilliant effort on the fence. Charging in. Cody Yusuf has done some brilliant ground. I didn't know they'd changed the field. I don't know if you can believe that, but uh, that was kind of what he was communicating, John John Smuts. Anyway, he has to be on his way. McCoy's struck. They've picked up their third so far. That's gone straight up in the air. Not easy a catch. Not easy. Well taken. Excellent. Really nicely done now by Jason Roy. What a knock, though, by Heinrich Klaassen. Of just the 17 deliveries when you thought DSG were going nowhere in that middle period. A brilliant catch from Jason Roy in the end to bring a close to the innings as well.